Shall I run it? Distinguished group in place are over in the East Room, and you'll be joining them again over there shortly. Oh, are you going to be? They're all there. Yes. 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 It's a lot of know how we just say hello to these other gentlemen. I want to be sure to say hello to everybody. Nice to see you again. 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 Janice Murray and Jack Bear with you. That's Bear with you. My old. Did ever tell you how we slipped in the kitchen? Share everything in the kitchen. Where is this girl? Where's Patsy Girl? Patsy's the one I still see. I'll go and she knows. Patsy. You had to have one kid. Every time. 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 Every time.
Ben, we'll you, sir. I'll see you over I'll see you by time. Yeah, Roger's here. Oh, is he? Great. Maybe we better do it now. Because uh, this thing may be running a little. Uh, is it four? I think thought it was yesterday. I know it was on yesterday. Frederick Heimer from West Chester, Ohio. Mr. Okay. President, I'm pleased to give you your registration card for the coming year. We are glad that you are continuing to be Scouting's honorary national president. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. I'm very proud and happy to have this. The next presentation is from Todd Clark from Delray Beach, Florida. He's an Eagle Scout and a Boy Scout National Youth Representative. Mr. President, this report includes the highlights for 1983, and we are proud to report that for the fourth consecutive year, we've had an increase in membership. Well, I am most proud and pleased to, I'm pleased to hear that, and very proud to have this, and this annual presenting of a, of a report is uh, one of the good things about this job here, and I'm glad to hear about the membership increase. Thank you. Thank you. The next present. The next presentation is by William O'Toole of Harleyville, South Carolina. He's the National Vice Chief of the Order of the Arrow, and he's going to give you a Catch the Scouting Spirit belt buckle. Well, thank you very much. Well, I'm pleased to have that. Awesome. Thank you. The next presentation is from uh, Chili White from Bend, Oregon, and he's the current National Explorer President and a youth member to our National Executive Board. And he's going to give you the latest issue of the Norman Rockwell Scouting Plate, appropriately entitled Tomorrow's Leader. Well, thank you very much. I'm pleased to have that. I knew Norman Rockwell. <laughs> and last, we want to present you with the 1984 Boy Scout calendar, which, which salutes volunteers. Andrea Elger, an Explorer Post president from Whitefish Bay, Wisconsin and Malcolm McClellan, a senior patrol leader from Seattle, Washington, are making this presentation. They were selected as outstanding youth leaders for 1983. Thank you very much. Congratulations to you. Thank you. Thank you. Me. And I know about the two major programs that Scouting has, and I commend you on both of them. I think they're wonderful. And thank you. Andrea is interested in government politics. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and we're Republican. <laughs> <laughs> well, Mr. President, thank you for your time, and I know that you're as proud of these young people yes, as we are. And I thank you also for presenting the Distinguished Eagle Scout Award to someone that is very special to me, Jim Brady. I know he must have appreciated that very much. We have two photos, one group photo, if we could uh, yeah, come around to the okay. side. Okay. Thank you, John. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
happy hunting in the political. <laughs> <laughs> This is the first model of the uh, sorry, New Jersey in its new configuration, the first official uh, model, and there's a plaque being prepared for it. But it is everybody involved with the New Jersey wanted you to have the official model of it. Then this is in the new configuration with the with the new CIWS uh, guns and the uh, the Greek Commission. Uh, well, so, uh, listen, I have to. I have to tell you, all my life I've been crazy about model boats, <laughs> and for years my greatest treasure was a World War I uh, destroyer, and I don't know where in all our family moves that it ever disappeared. Well, they assure this me thing. that this floats in the bathroom too, so it's, uh, it uh, can be used for lots of purposes. <laughs> or you <laughs> see the flag, he's got your flag up there. You're aboard there somewhere. I do, I <laughs> built two models of ships myself. Yeah, which I still have. Oh, that's well, great. Well, you built the real one of this, so that's the best <laughs> model you've ever your built. Ship. Maybe your ship. Maybe always calls that your ship. That's right. And you'll be pleased to know, I just got back from her, and she is in the best material condition. She's C2 after being out on this shakedown cruise now 10 months. She is in perfect condition. She's like a Swiss watch. It's just amazes everybody. And you know, we've been rotating the crew. I was just, you know, I was just going to ask about that. When you say that, with one thing I'm very happy about the ship, and then I keep thinking about it. Ten months. <laughs> no, the ten crew, months. Yeah, crew's yeah, being rotated. Well, well, one of the things CAP did was to start this integration of the reserves. So we are sending a hundred reserves out every couple of weeks, and, or every couple of weeks, and they let a hundred active duty go back to their families in Long Beach for three weeks. That's great. And then, uh, so it's a real reserve pitching in. So we it's managed to well. accelerate the delivery of the uh, aisle, Mr. President. So it will be ready in April instead of July. So yeah. that's, uh, that's another, uh, there'll be a twin to this. Right here. Yeah. Well, that's very, very good. All very sir, fine. sir, the uh, uh, task force asked you to say, because you know they had to go straight, they ran the grenade operation, then couldn't even stop by, they, they went straight to Beirut. So they sent this, uh, they wanted to send you this when they got back in Grenada, but they never got back. So here is your, to work out in, that's a Grenada t-shirt. That's just a little note from the task force. Well, we ought to have a commander. We, we have not make Make sure your daily workout. Great. <laughs> <laughs> my brass plate about the nutmeg coat. Yes. And this is their note I can respond to. Yeah. I'll take it. All right. All right. Good. All right. We hope it's a very happy birthday, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Very good indeed. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much for having us. We really appreciate it. We don't look 50 years old, do we? <laughs> <laughs> this is Dave Gellman, Rita Rodriguez, who's one of our board, best board members. My goodness. This is uh, Jim Sharp. Uh, may I pull it for you? Oh, yes, yeah. <laughs> I think you shouldn't be stuck on the game. Mr. President, thank you. Mr. President, good to see you all, sir. Thank you. I am uh, Lauren well, Lego. And this is my friend uh, Boner, Russ Boner, well, Mr. President, President of Public Affairs, Jim Hess. Hello. Jim Young, our, our short board member. <laughs> well, it's great to have us in. Well, say we again. Don't play it. Well, we're particularly <laughs> glad that you didn't accept that Amway distributorship. <laughs> <laughs> you were down felt. That's really marvelous. When I came in here, the broadcast of that night, I told the crew that I had two alternative speeches. One of them, I said, I teed off of that same joke I told them. One of them is that if they see me going door to door, I'm not soliciting folks, just selling as Amway cosmetics. <laughs> <laughs> Jim said he wanted a sub distributorship. <laughs> 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 well, 
Well, the X impact is 50 years old, and uh, I've done a good job for exports for you. And you know, uh, we made a hard pitch, and you were very kind to to compromise and help us uh, get the the support for you that we really feel. Now, how much so. is it that we funnel through there? Is, is it 120 or 130 billion dollars? <laughs> <laughs> just a lot of jobs, sir. A lot of jobs. <laughs> That's right. Uh, in, uh, in the history of well, in 50 years, it's been 120 billion dollars. Yeah, that's really true. And it's still so supporting the first billion dollars that went in is there still in reserves, and what's authorized each year at the, at the Congress is not uh, not lost money. It's author authority right now. We hope to get it all back. Mr. President, we need to do a nice group picture. Hey, why don't you let me take this? Yeah, trust me with this. Wow. <laughs> 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 we were just about to count right up on your phone. <laughs> yeah. They said, somebody. My appointment with Fred and Tobias. They said, it away if I dropped it. They <laughs> <laughs> said, now when the picture's taken, don't you bend it down so they can see the guy. <laughs> so do you want to come over this one? Okay. And, um, okay. You want to come over this side? We have plenty of room. Is it Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. We have one other thing for you, which is a little tile, which you may want to open right now. And, uh, and it's in the memento of the bank, 50 years old. It's a commercial. Just again, a real tough chip. Thank you very much.